we've got to today, we're going to be taking a look at all this fantastic Westwood A35 that's just come up on the work bridge. Okay, so here we are on board, and the first thing you notice about the Westwood A35 is the huge amount of space up here. For a 35 foot boat, it really is brilliant. Um, this is the 2009 model, it's fitted with a Yanmar 220 horsepower diesel engine, it has a fly by wire throttle controls, a Vetus bow thruster and stern thruster, it has a windscreen cover, holding tank, and a reversing camera, so maneuvering really is a dull. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get down and take a closer look. Okay, so down a few steps from the upper helm is the main saloon area with table. Moving forward over to starboard is the galley, which has an oven, four burner hob, double sink, and microwave. Down a few steps and over to port is the heads. She's a good size, has basin, toilet, and a shower. Moving forward is the V berth cabin. She's also a good size. Back round to the galley again. Which just leaves the master cabin aft. Which features a queen size island bed. And over to starboard is the heads which is a good size again has toilet, a basin, and then a separate shower moving aft. Okay, so this is the upper helm aft seat. The centre section here is removable so you can get access when you're moored stern on. Moving forward, twin helm seats. You can see the visibility is good. It's a full a fitted canopy which obviously folds down along with the radar arch. Helm controls here with Ray Marine nav equipment and radio. You can just see the reversing camera there in the center. Off to starboard is the windlass control and thruster. Balance done. Okay, so that's all we've got time for this week, but you can tune in next time for another exciting virtual tour on board. Um, for more information on this boat or any others, uh, feel free to give us a call on 01603 711 811 or you can visit us online at broombrokerage.com. Thanks a lot. See you next time.